What's up, guys? Um, let me shut my door. Uh, you can see that I am at my new house. But actually, uh, you can see that I got a new costume. Um, I did not make this one. I actually uh, got it for my birthday, which was a couple days ago, like two, two weeks ago probably. And um, I was really excited, but right when I got it, I was like, man, this is going to make me stop doing a lot of costumes. But um, no, it's actually not. I'm going to keep doing costumes. Uh, and you guys can actually should be excited because I started school. It feels good. Um, it's going good, um, and yeah, everything's fine, but let's get down to the costume, alright, and, um, this is a cosplay, it's not the real one, it's not, um, a real costume with all the stuff in it, but it has the four, uh, knife, the four knife holders, the sword holder, the uh, wallet and all the gadget holders right here and then to my side this is where you hook it on but right here is the main gadget holder has I have the strap or the belt and then right here I can put something in the back right here but um I made this video for you guys and I'm going to show you all of my uh, my weapons or my infantry. So, um, let's, uh, get to it. Alright. I'm trying to get it in the right spot. Alright. So, the first weapon is the hidden blade. I'll tell you I'll tie your tin blade, okay? Alrighty. Okay, so this is the same one I did in uh, one of my very first videos of making costumes. You guys probably remember this. I already made it out of cardboard and everything like that. Alright, so that's the first weapon, the primary weapon of an assassin. Second one, this one I haven't showed you guys at all. This is my first time showing you guys. So, here it is. It's just a sword. It doesn't fit in my back pocket. It's just one of those swords that, uh, um, I'll tell you, it pulls out in the middle of the game. It's just one of those swords. It's, probably, it's like a dagger sort of, kind of. Um, a lot of people say it looks like, uh, Edward, Edward Kenway's sword because it has the pirate look to it. But yeah. Hey. Okay. There's two. Another one. Another hidden blade. I'm not going to put this one on. Um, this one isn't as good as this one. But yeah, it, go, it does actually go on a bit easier. And the blade is a bit bigger than the other one. But yeah, um, it's just a regular hidden blade. I will be doing tutorials soon with hidden blades and all the stuff I made. This is my um, prototype knife. Here's a closer look. It's just paper because it's prototype. Uh, and here's one of my uh, favorite weapons. This one is homemade, but it's also, um, it works pretty well. Uh, it's just cardboard with the cardboard dart. Closer look for you guys. It's cardboard with the cardboard dart. And then uh, like a band. Like a stretchy band. And then it, it shoots good. But I haven't used it in a while. Here it is. It, it shoots good. Uh, that's another prototype. Um, Here's my very first hidden blade prototype. It's actually pretty good. It's um better than the other hidden blade I just showed you, but uh, it is not better than this one. This one right here 
it's pretty, it's really good. I was lucky when I made this one. This one came out very well. But, uh, aside from the cardboard showing and all that, I didn't use any duct tape to glue anything. I only put duct tape right here for a look, and I put duct tape right here because it ripped. But, when I first made it, it did not have duct tape or nothing. It was just glue right there. So, here's a prototype. I get a lot of credit for this one. It's like a machete sort of kind of. It's um, Adderwell's. If you don't know who Adderwell is, go to all my videos and you'll see him. Um, my little brother plays Adderwell in my uh, video. He is not a made up character, but this is his um, uh, sword. He plays in Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry or in Assassin's Creed 4 Freedom Cry for PS3. But this is sword. It's like a machete, but it, it can hook and everything like that. This is my prototype of the belt. You see this one? This one should go over top like that. I was gonna make a gonna make it like a uh, duct tape costume, but then I got this one, so I was like, oh, okay, whatever. And my last weapon or sword of kind of, This is what I do to make Kingdom Blades. I take a cardboard piece like this. I just compare it with this one. If it's good, if it's good, then I, I just compare it like that. That's how I compare it. And then um, I cut this that out. And yeah, but um, I hope you guys liked this video. It was kind of um, not a, not a uh, dramatic video like all my others. But um, I made it to show you my weapons in my costume. Last look at it. My action pack is right here. Like that, or like this, or like this one. But um, yeah, I will be making. I, I, I don't worry. I still make um weapons and stuff like that. And uh, stay tuned. All right, this is my uh, first video in a long time. About two, about a month or so. This is September eighth or ninth. Can't remember. But um, see you later. I hope you like the video. Alright, assassin out.